Hey everyone, it's Mayor Robert Garcia, and I'm just really happy to join in this virtual uh, celebration and really reopening of our amazing concession areas over at Granada and Guanapero, uh, right along the beach bike path. Now, of course, I ride my bike up and down uh, the path all the time, and I've seen the progress of these amazing spaces. Uh, really excited, I've been a strong supporter of these projects uh, from day one, and in fact, we're really excited they're gonna be a big part also of our Olympics and uh, really welcoming visitors, and they're a part of our uh, eight by 28 projects in the city of Long Beach. Uh, to get ready for the Olympics. Um, these are gonna be great spaces for our residents and visitors to come by, to hang out, uh, to ha have something to eat, uh, spend time with family. So I'm really, really excited. Um, just wanna congratulate the entire team for this amazing project and very excited. And I'm looking forward to spending some time there. These new improvements to the concession stands are going to really activate the beach in a way that we've not been able to do before. Uh, when we first put in the pedestrian path and the bicycle path, we started to see a lot more people coming out and using the beach. Um, and now that we've had the playgrounds here, it's going to allow people to be able to use the playground areas, have family time, but also be able to utilize the, pede the pedestrian pathway and the bike pathway uh, to get to and from locations. So it's just really going to activate the entire space um, and make this area feel even more alive than it has since we put in these paths. Both of the concession stands dif offer different active play areas. Um, the one at Montepero offers a climbing structure and opportunity for kids of all ages to be able to utilize it and still feel challenged and have some fun active play. The one at the Granada a concession stand has a water feature involved in it, which allows kids to really integrate the elements of the beach uh, and the sand and, and play in that space uh, in, in a more fun and playful way. Here today, you know, we're really showcasing, I think, is a, a great example of what we're really known for, and that's community engagement and really having a conversation with our neighbors in terms of what they'd like to see uh, Parks, Recreation, and Marine plan, build, uh, and then offer for, for their enjoyment. So behind me is one of our coolest new playgrounds here at Wanapero Beach, and uh, we have just a lot of uh, great recreational amenities surrounding this new play space. So yeah, this particular part of the beach is really, uh, again, a great destination. Rosie's Dog Beach is just a bit further up the beach and I think for a lot of dog owners and their four-legged furry friends, they really find that as a great place to uh, come out and, and socialize, uh, but also just enjoy the beauty of our coastline and uh, all the, the recreational fun that the community is having. You'll see, you know, people on bikes, on rollerblades, uh, just jogging, running, pushing their, their kids in strollers. But uh, I think it reflects the commitment that Long Beach has to its residents to provide recreational amenities for us to stay uh, healthy and fit and just enjoy recreating in some beautiful spaces. The Department of Public Works is very excited. Uh, we've been working uh, on the planning, design, and construction uh, of this project uh, for a few years. Um, this project is actually a culmination of various improvements that we've done in the waterfront in the last few years. So these two new playgrounds are the latest um, improvements that we are happy to unveil to the community and uh, we're uh, really excited to see people take advantage of them. We very carefully selected the design, the color palettes, uh, the, the hardscape and landscape uh, elements to really ensure that we would help beautify the area. Some of the amenities that we've uh, added as part of this project um, include uh, new shade structures, uh, various bike facility improvements, new landscaping and signage, um, and all of these uh, improvements really add to the usability of the area. 